The Pacific Northwest is dotted with dangerous volcanoes. No, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not worried. Should I be? It scares you. Sure it does. It's got to. That's according to a recent report by the USGS. The U.S. Geological Survey National Volcanic Threat Assessment. 11 of the 18 yes. U.S. volcanoes That's ranked as very high threats are in Washington, Oregon, and California. Mount St. Helens, Mount Rainier, Mount Shasta in Northern California, still part of the Cascades, Mount Hood, Three Sisters. Geologist Dave Ramsey co-authored the report and works at the Cascades Volcano Observatory in Vancouver. They watch for activity and analyze wind direction every day, just in case ash gets thrown in the air. Most times, that is what will happen. Ramsey says most of the cone-shaped volcanoes you see in our area have the potential for a devastating and explosive eruption like Mount St. Helens in 1980. Ash is the biggest threat to the metro area, but mudslides have made it down to East County from Mount Hood before. So Lahar is on the east side of, of Portland, Sandy, Troutdale. That's definitely a concern from a future event at, at Mount Hood. Ramsey says denser populations are living closer to volcanoes than they did a decade ago. Air traffic is also more congested, could be impacted from future eruptions. And so what we can do on the USGS side is to work on research and to work on our volcano monitoring. There are many volcanoes in the Cascades that don't have the monitoring that we'd like to see on them or that others have advised that we should have on it. So we'd like to be able to increase that and use this report to do that. With hazards all around us, he says the best way to stay safe is to be prepared. Volcanoes usually provide us with time, weeks, days, months in advance. In Vancouver, Brian Brennan, KGW News.